okay we have a Toshiba laptop here that does not uh, have any activity at all it doesn't come up at all it turns on because when we press the power button you can see the power uh, LED turn on but there's no activity on the hard drive uh, so this particular laptop has what's a, a video video issue so we, we're gonna have to reflow the the motherboard and uh, what that does is actually re reconnects the video chip uh, so if you have a laptop and you feel comfortable doing this yourself you can just reflow the the video chip on the motherboard and you should be okay this is a fairly new laptop uh, they tend to overheat and that will cause it to um, uh, have an issue with the video chip and that tends to be the problem here with this computer uh, so we do not take any responsibility if you break anything on the laptop that's totally up to you if you want us to do this you, you may contact us via email follow us on YouTube subscribe uh, send us an email with the type of uh, laptop you have and we will reply back with the cost on the repair uh, it's fairly uh, cheap uh, for us to do this so um, give us a call uh, if you are going to ship the laptop over to us so we can take your information other than that do not give us a call subscribe to the channel post your questions if you have anything related to the video uh, on these particular models uh, we will take this apart again you have to be mechanically inclined to do this do not take it apart if you're not okay yeah. okay we've taken the computer apart and there's a good possibility that the reason for the problem is the accumulation of uh, dust in the heat sink if you notice on here you see all this dust if you take it apart yourself make sure to clean this out uh, it's gonna need new thermal um, paste on here and also there uh, we're gonna change this to uh, to uh, copper so because this is pretty much not as a good conductor of heat so uh, we are gonna reflow the, the motherboard uh, we have the reflow machine here so uh, we will start that in a few seconds okay uh, we started the reflow process on this uh, you can use a heat gun but uh, this actually distributes the heat correctly on, on the chip itself and we do it for about two, two minutes uh, and uh, we have the settings on here this is an actual uh, machine that we got from China uh, let's say about a year ago and uh, we use this to do the, the reflow and also to uh, replace chips on the motherboards so uh, again this is at your own risk we we've been trying to do this um, we're certified as well with a few vendors uh, again we are not responsible if you damage your board uh, again subscribe to our channel if you if you have questions do not call us uh, as we will not help you over the phone so if the only time you want to call is if you're going to send the laptop over. Okay, okay the, the reflow has been done on the video chip now. So now what we're going to do is we're going to turn on the laptop. Now if you did it right, uh, it should work without a problem. Again, remember, press the power. You'll notice if we have video. So there we go. So the, the computer is back up and running. Uh, activity lights coming on on the hard drive. Notice here where my finger is. And this is a fairly new machine, it's a Windows 7 uh, computer, it's a little bit over a year old. So um, again, it could be a combination of the dust on the heatsink and uh, the laptop uh, maybe being left on way too long uh, without being used. Who knows, <clears throat> but that seemed to fix the problem. Again, this is uh, a video to show you how to fix that particular video issue where the computer does not turn on at all. Uh, if you want us to do this for you, I will highly recommend that uh, and not do it yourself. You'll save a lot of money uh, on sending it to us. We'll take it apart, put it back together, and you should be okay. Again, subscribe to our channel, post your questions, 
and we will be able to help you uh, if you subscribe and post your questions. If you do not subscribe, we will not reply to your comments. Thanks again, and uh, until we make the next video, uh, I'll talk to you again. Bye.